Hey guys, welcome back. It's Kirsten. Welcome back to Kirsty's Corner. And today I'm going to be following a Bob Ross painting tutorial because this year, like I'm not usually one for New Year's resolutions, but ever since going to like college and even like last year, um, I've been really busy and not really putting as much time into um, art as I'd like to. So to, that's what I'm doing today. I'm part of this art club at Michigan, so that's going well. But we did one of these and it's super fun. I'm trying to get better at painting and drawing. Um, so today I'm improving my painting and I also wanted to work on uh, videos for this channel um, Just producing more things. So I thought this would be an interesting way to do so um, But yeah, I'm super excited uh, The link to the episode I'm following is down below. It's Bob Ross evening's piece season 19 episode 12 um, So I'll link that and also um, the Bob Ross channel uploaded like all the episodes So if you want to look at any of them, they're all on there um, but yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, so this is the setup um, for today, just so you can like see what I'm doing. My laptop's right there. Um, I have my headphones, so and it's plugged in because I didn't charge them. But um, I'm gonna be wearing these during the video because I'm not really sure what the copyright is for this. So if you do want to follow along, um, you can see what I'm working on. And yeah, I'll be listening to this and just talking, I guess. I don't know. Um, I tend to make a lot of comments while I'm doing stuff, but I guess let's get into it. I'm gonna see what colors I need. This is gonna be interesting though, because I put, we, so I don't, here, I'll just move this really big. So we have this cardboard, and usually I do it flat, and, um, my sister and I just put the paint straight up on the cardboard. So, we'll see how that goes. Okay, let's see what pop in colors he wants. Usually they're like weird named colors, but that's like the actual colors that the painting company named them. But who knows? Oil paints are not what I like. So, see, like, this is just licorice. Like, that's pretty simplistic. But some of them are, like, really weird. Titan okay, so titanium white. Okay. Okay, so he started out with a black canvas, so I guess I'll do that real quick. Um, I'm going to shut the camera off because that's pointless. It's just the color black, whatever. Okay, so I painted this black, and I attempted to also wet it down a bit because, okay, so the thing I love about acrylics um, is that they dry fast, but for this, since he's using oil paints and he likes to blend and stuff, like, that's kind of against what I need. So... For this process, it'll be interesting, so if it's really shiny, that's because I'm trying to make it, like, kind of wet-ish, so maybe that'll help? I don't know. Okay, let's start. Okay. Uh, clear. Oh, wait, he used acrylic paint, so this is fine. So then that, now, shoot, this needs to, needs to, like, I'm gonna thin this out so it dries a little bit. Okay, so just a little bit of tight. Okay, one minute. I need to clean this brush. Because the brush he's using is kind of big right now. And I don't have a brush that big. So we're this is the biggest one I have. Oh, okay. Do like a little the little thing where it's like, I don't even know if this is focusing. I don't even know how this works. Okay, um, I gotta open up this white to paint. Um, this is the Craft Smart. Uh, yeah, this is not fo focusing, but like, yeah, I don't know how this works, but uh, it's the Craftsmart one. It's the cheapest because I'm on a budget, and so all of my paint is really cheap, so this is going to just not end well, probably, but you know, you never know. I can't open this. One minute. Ah! I usually, oh. Oh my god, I actually opened it. Okay, that's just gonna go over there. Okay, so he's taking... Jesus. Okay, so white. Okay, what's he doing? He said don't put too much on the brush. So we're just gonna... Oh, I forgot my brush is kind of wet. Well, whatever. Okay, 
make a decision. Nice moon up here. Uh, okay, so we're making a moon. Uh, okay, boy. <coughs> okay, so we're crisscrossing and blending outward. And it's gonna get darker and darker and darker as you get away from the break. Okay, I'm unplugging this. Oh, shoot. It's supposed to be bluish black. I don't know. Oh, black gesso might have blue in it. Who knows? Shoot. It's not really blending, but... Shoot. Too much water. Too much water. Okay, this is too wet, so I'm just gonna tap it a little bit. Okay, so I don't know how much you can see. That's what it looks like right now. And so basically, here, maybe. Oh, there we go. Um, so it's like work it outwards, but since my it's acrylic, it's like not blending. And I don't know how he did it, cause I know it's oil paint, but like he did it on top of acrylic. I'm amazed. This man is amazing, and he has blue somehow. Like this does not look right, but. Oh, he has some thinner thingy. Shh. Okay, I'm gonna blend out the sky first and then we'll see what happens. Okay, so I did the best I could in blending this out. It's very dark. His is so much lighter. And, like, I just... It just keeps drying on me, which is what I, I knew was going to happen. But it's fine. It's still... I Sorry about the lighting. I just don't know how to get this to stay while I'm doing this. But whatever. I might have to hold it so this might look really awkward. My arm looks really weird in that angle. But whatever. Um, so... I'm supposed to blend this out, but you know, it's just like kind of hard because when you, when I'm doing this, it's thinning it out, and so then it's just drying really fast. And I can't, I just can't deal with it. And then I'm just like, oh, that brush was not clean. Well, I guess I need to blend that out again. That was not a good, I'm, I'm sometimes I question my abilities. And you're like, oh my god, like, you're so good. I'm like, girl, I barely know what I'm doing at all times. Including when I, I just ruined it. I worked so hard on that. <sighs> this is ladies and gents and people of all things. We're all, you know, it's just, it's just hard. You know, if you ever into art um you know you make a lot of mistakes and you just kind of not mistakes happy accidents <laughs> um it's just it's really hard sometimes and you're like wow i just really did that and that is not a good thing but yeah i don't know if you can, you cannot see what i'm doing but that's what this kind of looks like i guess let's try and blend this I'm just going around 
and trying to create this texture that he has. Um, because it's more like roundish instead of like brush stroke, like rectangular looking stuff. It's supposed to be lighter in one area, so I chose like right here ish. Um, I'm gonna try and blend in a little bit more white. So it's, I think it's supposed to be like semi cloudy. And then I have to put a moon there, but you gotta make this like kind of emphasized, you know? Let's see how emphasized did he do it? Oh, shoot. Okay, there we go. Um, oh, he made it like pretty emphasized. And his looks really pretty. I'm just, you know, rolling with the punches, as I, I like to say. To be proper. Awesome. Alright. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it, kind of. Yeah, wow. Okay, so this video has been probably kind of boring because it's all, like, the screen looks, like, black to me when I see it on me. So see the canvas? Okay, whatever. Um, This is the best I can do at this point in time. But um, I'm going to try and get a, like, stand thing. Not an easel. I'm not talking about an easel. Like, for my phone. So that I can angle everything correctly. And then, um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. I'm trying to blend in this blackish blue into, and then put more white in this area. Because it's supposed to be lighter. But I actually got some black in there. So, it's just going to be an interesting color, I guess. I don't know. This is going to... So originally I had filmed a New Year's like Eve like get ready with me and like a to know me thing and I was like that's gonna be so long to edit so I just deleted it all and also it was kind of boring and my sister swore too much I swore a little bit in this videos but and I was like that's gonna be heck to that's gonna be like hell to edit that's not swear word so whatever it's gonna be hell to edit this is really gonna take so long because this video is just gonna be a lot of footage okay um anyways so I'm gonna add my little moon because I. I like, kind of like how that looks. It looks decent, I guess. You just put a little circle. Shoot, this circle's not circular. Okay, let's see. Oh, he used his finger. That's so smart. Oh, clean, dry brush. Okay, so he just like use a clean, dry, dry brush to like brush over this stuff, and then it's like, what? This looks like I'm. Oh, I guess it like kind of works. But now like the moon's like away, away. Okay, I'm gonna do that like. Uh, okay. Um, he's going way too fast. Uh, that's the one problem I remember there being when I did this in my club. It's like, he was going so fast, we kept having to, having to pause it, and we just, like, got lost. So, some people gave up. I, like, tried not to, but it was definitely a challenge, because he was just going so fast. Like, Bob, my dude, like, we're not professionals. I'm gonna let that drag a little bit before I, like, crisscross it. So he was like, take a little job. Made it a little bit. It does look nice. It makes it look like there's like. I don't know if you can see that, but. Oh, you like kind of see it. That's what this like lighter thing is. Is the moon. Okay. Um. Yeah, it looks really bad. This is actually a roast yourself challenge. Okay, I have no idea what he said in the last time. We what color is this? Okay, what are you using? Are you using black? Dude, like, does not give instructions. So, we're doing cloud. Oh, he's using the fan brush. Which one is that? Okay, so he's making clouds with um, this brush. With the black. 
So I'm using the corner. What? This man is so talented. I wish. So I'm going to thinly put that on my brush. Boys, like, you're just going to, it's just fun painting. I don't really care. Dude, I care. He's so like, oh, he's like telling me some intellectual stuff right now. Okay, um, boy's still going to, he's really creating these clouds. These clouds, I don't know if you can tell, they look really... You can see the spot. Oh, dude, I'll, I'll paint like this. It's a really weird angle. So you can see my elbow. It's really cute. Okay, and I'm going to take my dry brush again and just like... He's like, the paint is... Um, it is not wet, sir. I'm gonna go over this with like a little bit of wet. So he was like, it's wet, you can like blend it. I was like, no, I didn't know it was supposed to be wet, honey. Okay, so I, is that, okay, what, what are you saying, sir? Oh, okay, so he's making like a light blue. So I'll do that after I blend this out a little bit. Okay, this doesn't look like terrible. It's not great. It doesn't look terrible. Okay, so since the moon is there, I also need to still have to mix this. What? Is, oh, he's using a fan brush again. I, unlike him, only have one. He has like multiple of everything. Okay, so he mixed white blue. Okay, so I have white already. Follow your imagination. I will. But I also. Okay, I need more white in this. The color mixing, I will show you this after, like, the cardboard is literally a mess. Okay, so. Oh, you can, okay, this is, like, kind of working out. It's, like, going. <laughs> okay. Um, but what can I talk about? <laughs> I just really need to concentrate. Like, I was going to talk in this video about, like, random stuff, but I don't think I have the, like, this man's is going so fast. I don't think I'm going to, okay, I also should add more of the moon in there somehow. She can also be done with the dry brush. So that's where like the moon is. Oh, it's like, it's like kind of coming together. Okay, I'm proud of me. Um, I'm gonna let this dry a little bit before I like, oh, I guess I can do the clouds. Oh. Ugh. I just scraped it with my nail. Are you kidding me? I'll just like... Okay, we're gonna pat some black on top of that. So I accidentally messed up the moon because I was trying to make the moon look cool and then I ruined it. Okay, we're gonna pause Bob Ross. Uh, I'm gonna fix this real quick. Okay, so I like semi fixed it. I don't know. It it kind of worked, but we'll see. Okay. Um, what is he doing now? Okay, I like totally missed this whole part. Okay. Okay, little bushes and stuff. Okay. 
Uh, what am I tapping firmly into? Okay, so I think he's just dabbing black paint onto this randomly. Making bush shapes. Okay. They're like kind of really, really dark blue. So we're gonna add a drop of that, I guess. Where did my other blue, oh, I should have added that blue paint. That one's definitely a better color than use this one. Okay. Okay, so bush shapes into the... Oh shoot, this is way too wet. Okay. Okay. I don't know why his black is like bluish. It looks so nice. Sorry, there's like an absence of me talking. Um, what? Okay, so now he's tapping into this like light blue color. Okay, firmly tap that color right into the bristles. Okay, just using leftovers. Okay, I like kind of my bush shapes. I very gently go right above the dark. Wait, so is he just doing one end? Oh, okay, so the whole treat, okay. Okay, so he's using a round brush, but I don't own one of those. I need to get actual art supplies, I think, maybe. I'm gonna be an art miner. I'm a fake right now. Oh, uh -huh. he's so nice for these trees. He's like, this one's getting left out. We can't do that. And I'm like, boy, I don't think they care. But like, that's cute. This like doesn't look half bad. On camera, it looks much better I think I don't know oh he's reminiscing he's like I'm gonna go back home and see my friends which is what I'm on Christmas break or er, holiday break I I have the tendency to call it Christmas break it's not that's I need to rewire my brain he's scraping the, I can't scrape this so we're just gonna keep dabbing I guess more tree like I was so confused on what I was painting okay so but yeah I'm really, really excited I wow I really got off track but I'm really excited to see my friends from high school but I'm also really excited to go back like next week because I do miss all my college friends that I met like they're, they're oh miss them it's like weird not seeing them every day and like that was the same thing about high school, but at least, like, you have summer to, like, kind of weed that out, because then you don't see them every day during the summer. But you see, like, some of the days during summer? Okay, I'm pausing you, Bob. Um, or, like, college, I just saw them every day, and then you go straight to not seeing them at all. Like, because most of my friends left, like, earlier than I did by a bit, So, but, like, all at the same time, pretty much, except for, like, a few people. So... It was weird not seeing them all the time. Okay, that's like decent. Okay, so next he took like this white and he's like, it's okay if there's blue in it, but my canvas is not wet. So I'm gonna have to like streak these together, I think. Ooh, what if I add like a little bit of turquoise in there? We'll do that. Well, look nice, maybe. Okay. So he's taking his like fluffy brush, so I'm just gonna use the one I was using. Streak it a little bit. Add more white, maybe. This is a lot more wet than his, but 
Um, he's just making this river. Let's go back a little bit. Okay. Okay. So, oh, he's using a very flat brush. I don't think I have one of those. We're just going to flatten this brush that I've been using. So, just go to like. Okay, he's like, swoosh it back and forth. Okay, this actually looks like decent. Hey, dude. Okay. This is kind of hard. This looks like, okay. But, oh, he's putting more bushes in. One minute, girt, boy. I'm trying to add more color because he's like, Look at all those colors that are coming from the canvas. But since mine is all acrylic instead of just the background, the, the go, got, I don't remember what to use. Like that looks like, okay, I'm gonna try and Okay, and then, okay, so he's now putting trees in front, I don't know. Okay, so I'm using, okay, what is he doing? Oh, he's getting fancy. <coughs> what? He's putting a cabin? This is, oh, I thought this was a river. Well, I guess I'll put it right here. I can't really remove the excess paint like he's doing. So I guess I'll, he's, I also don't have the scrapey tool. Uh, so I really like art, but I don't know, like, any of the terms. We'll use this, like, angled brush, I guess. I don't know. Okay, so he painted like this house and I'm trying to make a nice house that like looks nice at least. This one, I guess. This brush is covered in paint. Okay. Okay, so there's like little, oh, this is blocked. I, that's been blocked this whole time. So this is where the cabin is. I'm, Okay, we're gonna pause you. Okay, so I totally missed this step because he started painting this cabin, and I was like, okay, I'll do this cabin first. But I'm adding the windows right now. He's like, someone's home cooking dinner, probably, and I was like, that's cute. Um, comment down below what you would be cooking in your cabin in the middle of the snowy wonderland. I like. What would I be cooking? I love. Other fun fact: I really enjoy cooking. Um, pretty much anything, so that's why I'm having a hard time right now thinking of what I would cook, because I do not know anything. Um, in a cabin, I guess something with bread, because bread seems like a cabin food, I don't know. But, um, yeah, he, okay, he added snow to the top of this, so we're gonna do that. I think it's like a very muted version of his. I don't know. Somehow he got color on the canvas, like to stay. And it's like in the black is like kind of a bluish black. And I'm, I'm not really sure how he did that, but he did because he's Bob Ross. So and we're just trying not to make too many happy accidents. <laughs> uh, that's a cabin. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna add some of those random bushes he was talking about. So I never did that. Okay, so just like Okay, so I guess we're moving on. So um what he did next was he continued this thing. So we're gonna add more blue this time. And there's gray underneath. Just because like it's supposed to get darker or something, because your 
foregrounds technically like if you're outside um your foreground is pretty much going to be darker than your background because your light source is in the back it's like the one thing i know and as you move forward get, things get darker and like bolder and bigger and stuff i guess i don't know i don't know how else to put it okay Oh, that needs more white. Change the flavor, flavor, flavor. He's like using interesting vocabulary right now. Why did he move to the tree? This is all supposed to be snow. He's like, don't let it get too bright on you. And I'm like, well, sorry, Bob. That's what I did. Can we add some black, maybe? He's like, add like random snow. Okay, and he mixed, and he, this is basically the color, so I'm not even gonna mix. Um, I'm just like pad this onto one of this. It's like this is maybe this is the tree. Okay. Blend it a little bit because this is a black tree. Whoa, what did he do? He added a evergreen tree. I'm not sure what kind of tree this is. Oh, I'm not back. Okay, so he added an evergreen. So I'm assuming he's using... None of these are clean. Anyways, I'm assuming... Oh, this has been blocking it. Whatever. Um, He's using the fan brush. So I'm going to do that again. Oh, he added all this new snow. I thought he wasn't going to put more snow. Okay, well, this is what I have so far. It looks decent, actually, in my opinion. But is he adding another cabin? He is. Okay, well, got to spread this out. Okay, so that took forever. So I blended this out in. I don't know what that is. Um, he started making a cabin, so I'm about to do that. Um, he did that weird scraping thing again. I don't have a scraper, so. But luckily, acrylic's really easy to layer. So he added like a cabin like over here, and I'm just, for the sake of the video, and my concentration, I'm just gonna follow what he did. I can like don't have to really think about the shape too much because his looks really nice so it's like why not okay so that's the roof okay and what he does is he like 
That's a little bit of white. Okay, so I mixed brown and black. And then put a little bit of white in it and just like dragged it down. Also, if you hear shouting back, my sister's watching some movie. I'm not really sure what she's watching, but. That like looks decent, I guess. I'm gonna add some of these like yeah, it's like streaks in this. I like that, so add some texture. Okay, now white for the roof. Just like kind of lightly, he said. But, like So that's, you can kind of see it, but I tried to do the roof, and the roof was kind of hard, so I'm just going to... Uh, Kirsten! Yeah? I'll make you the seafood uh, gyozas. Okay. I forgot that I was doing my roof like a weird shape. Um, so it's just kind of sh jank, that's fine on that out a little bit it's a bit dreamy okay and he has like this weird dark line underneath from four okay and then he has like textury shape i don't know how he got such a nice like texture in his barn just the dark and the light together I'm like randomly putting it on my brush. Okay. Then he put this like little side thing. He's like, look how easy it is to just add a building. My man, it is a lot harder than you may think. But thanks for believing in me, I guess, Bob. Okay, so. Did you see that? Very nice. Okay. That like looks half decent. Add a little more white to this roof. Okay, that looks okay. That's good enough for me. <sighs> oh, that's how he added a texture. He's like going like this. Okay. So. He just like scraped into the paint. That was amazing. Okay. I forgot to add the light brown. And that makes it look really nice. Okay. And some of the dark brown. Okay, and he added a door. I thought this was supposed to be darker because it's in the foreground. Sir. I guess they're both in the direct path, so it's fine. <gasps> this is so stressful. Okay, there's a whole backstory to this barn, apparently. That's like the door. And then, okay, so then the way he like fixed the front was like he added white and blended it into that snow that we did earlier. Okay, sorry. There's like, oh, my painting situation is usually chaotic, like, so sorry. Um, okay, so it's like on a hill. That makes sense. Nice hillage, maybe. I'm 
make him like a nice hill because he has one on a nice hill and I was like that looks good and he's adding like a cute little fence is it in white oh that looks so okay he did this cool trick I used to do this you like put two colors next to each other and then you like streak it and then you put your brush through it and it looks really nice okay so okay <gasps> here's one that broke okay so Okay, this brush is too thick. Why this thinner? This one's like kind of thin. Okay. So you take it and you like streak it so it's like. Okay, you that's blurry. But it's like. So you see it's like kind of not co one color. So. Okay, this is gonna be hard to do at this angle. Okay, I need more brown. And this weird streak. And then like brush it lighter so you can't see it. And it goes off. His looks so nice. His was also rotated a different way. Mm -hmm. Okay, well it's done. Like thirty minutes later, let me show you my masterpiece. Okay, so this is the finished product. Yeah. Um, I guess. I'll insert probably like a photo or something, but this is what happened. So, I it's actually not bad, I don't think, but it's not the best thing I've ever painted. Um, also, this is on a drawing pad, so that also might have done something. Um, it's not paper that's meant for painting, it's for drawing. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, this is the final product. Also, this is the this is the setup of my thing. Uh, this is a mess, as you can see. Here, I'll move the painting with the. Oh shoot. Okay, this was my setup so that the box wouldn't move. And this is the painting. That's my laptop. Water. If you made it to the end, thank you for watching. It was. I'm sorry it was so long, but painting is a process, um, and there wasn't a lot of talking because you really do need to focus. And also, sometimes I get lost when I'm doing art, so then. There's just no talking to be done. But, um, yeah, this took a lot of my concentration. Um, I definitely want to practice more because it is still fun, even though I was, like, not, I wasn't stressed. I was just, like, dude, this is going so fast. But it's, like, very calming. So, thank you. I hope you enjoyed. Look at my hand. This is what happens every time you do art. But, um, yeah. Thank you for watching, and peace out.